So we are making a cute little paper sculpture. So this is like two little boats and they're going through a tunnel. Okay, and everything's made out of just paper and tape, glue, scissors, markers, all easy stuff. Okay, so we have a nine by 12 piece of paper and I cut it in half. So we have two pieces. All right, and so one is the base or the, uh, the water, the ground and the water. And then the other one we use to make the, um, the bridge and, or tunnel and the boats. So the other one, I fold down the middle, fold in half the long way. Sometimes we call that the hot dog. And then I'm gonna cut on that fold. So I have two even pieces. And then for the boats, I fold it in half, so then I have two boats. And all I do is just make a little slit. Okay, two little slits on one end, and then two little slits on the other end. Okay, so these are my two boats. And then I just fold in these all these sides. Okay. So everything just gets folded up. And then I just overlap them and then you can glue it together or you can tape it. So when we use the tape, we just take a little piece and we put our thumb right at the end here. To rip off a piece and then I do like the same thing on the other side here. Just fold these in or they could even be on the outside. It doesn't really matter. However you want your boat design to look. and then tape them in. Okay, so there's one boat. I'm gonna do the same thing with my other one. Just where I made my little cuts, I'm gonna fold in. Both ends. Along the side. Along the other side. Fold it up, tape it up. Fold it up, tape it up. Okay, and then my last piece, and then of course I could add a little wheel, um, make some little designs along the sides, maybe give my boat a name. Some people name their boats. And then I just drew some uh, water along the edge. So here's the line for the ground. And then I just colored in in between the ground for the water. And on my, um, my bridge or my tunnel, I just make a little fold at the end here. Okay, one little fold there. Fold on the other side. And then I tape this where I want it to go. And then I just colored mine with markers. And I decided to do gray to sort of make it look like a stone archway but you could design yours however you want and color yours in the way that you want. 
Okay, and then there's my little boats that can go floating through along the river on my paper sculpture. I hope yours turns out just wonderfully for you, and I hope you have a great day.